Hey mathematics learners, welcome to Distance Learning with Lee, where I make learning mathematics super easy. So it has come to my attention that I actually forgot to, or I actually left out question 3.1.3b, right? From the grade 12 mathematical literacy paper 2 that was written in November 2022, right? So in this video tutorial, guys, I'm going to quickly do the solution um, for question B, right? So just quickly pay attention, right? So remember, in question A, right, we had already calculated or proved how they got the volume of 52.346 centimeters cubed, right? So we already done that in question 3.1.3, right? And in question 3.1.3b, right, we need to now determine, right, round it to the nearest gram, the mass of the glue in the print container if the density of the glue is 0 0.82 grams per centimeters cubed. Okay, so what is density, guys, right? Density is basically the mass, right, that an object has per unit volume. Okay, so how much mass we have in a container per one unit of volume. Okay, so that is what we're basically talking about when we are talking about density. Okay, so how are we going to basically uh, determine the mass of the glue in the print container if we are given the density of this uh, print container? Okay, so nicely, we are given what the formula is, that density is equal to mass divided by volume okay right and in the previous um question right we had already calculated what the volume was in centimeters cubed right so all that we need to do now is we now need to take this formula that is given to us of density is equal to mass um divided by volume right and substitute all our known values for us to basically obtain what the mass of um the glue in the print container it's all right so just quickly follow with me all right okay so like i mentioned in question 3.1.3 that i actually did in the previous video tutorial this was us just doing question a okay but i actually forgot to do question b so that is basically what we're doing now this is question 3.1.3 b from the grade 12 mathematical literacy paper 2 that was written in november 2022 okay so i forgot to do this question okay so here we basically need to calculate what is the mass of this glue that is in this print container right and we're given the formula the density right is equal to the mass divided by the volume right and then in the previous question right we already proved or shown how the obtained the volume of 52.346 centimeters cubed right so we already know that the volume of the glue right is actually equal to 52.346 centimeters cubed right so now all that we need to do now right we need to basically use this volume as well as the density that is given to us right we're given the density of the glue in the print container as 0 0.82 grams per centimeters cubed okay and we are now going to substitute all these uh, values into this formula to basically solve for our mass okay or to determine what our mass is so we can also write this equation as density is equal to the mass divided by the volume okay so we can also write it like that okay and what are we trying to do we are trying to determine what is the mass right so how can we do that how can we isolate the mass right on the right hand side all that you need to do right you basically need to um do the inverse of division because we've divided by the volume so for us to cancel out the volume on the right hand side so that we have the mass on its own we just need to therefore multiply by the volume okay 
on the right hand side because when you multiply by the volume on the right hand side right what we notice the volume and the volume will cancel okay and if you multiply by the volume on the right hand side you also need to multiply by the volume on the left hand side what you do on the left you also need to do on the right okay so what do we see now here right the volume cancels with the volume meaning that for us to determine or obtain what the mass of the glue is in the pret container right we basically just need to take the volume and we need to multiply that by the density okay so from here we just need to substitute right here we are happy we don't have to change our units right because we can see that the units for volume is in centimeters cubed we can see that the units for grams i mean for the density is grams per centimeters cubed so we see that those are going to basically cancel right so we don't have to do any conversions here so we're just gonna plug everything into our formula the way that it is to basically calculate the mass of the print or the mass of the glue in the print container okay so it's going to be 52.346 centimeters cube that is the volume right multiplied by right so we can also just write that as 52.346 centimeters cube divided by one okay multiplied by what is the density the density is 0 0.82 grams per centimeters cubed right so you have to write it like this guys so that you see that now your units are basically cancelling right so what do we notice in this case the centimeters cubed and the centimeters cubed will cancel right so this is going to give us what the mass is of our glue okay and then if you punch this into your calculator 52.346 multiplied by 0.82 right you'll have your answer in units in grams because those are the units that basically didn't cancel okay so if you punch that into your calculator you'll find that the mass of the glue in the print container is actually equal to 42 point nine two three seven two grams okay that is the mass right and we know that that is fine because we were told in this question right that we basically need to determine round it off to the nearest gram so we know that our units need to be in grams so we are basically happy with that all that we need to do now we need to round off this answer to the nearest gram so if we round off to the nearest gram they're basically saying that you need to round off to the nearest whole number right so we don't want to have any decimals okay so in this case this we're going to look at this nine this nine will basically tell us what we basically need to do um to this too and because this nine is a number that is greater than five okay okay that means that we need to make that 42.92372 grams into 43 grams okay so that is basically i can actually just write it like this therefore our mass okay therefore our mass is equal to 43 or approximately equal to 43 grams okay rounded off to the nearest gram okay and that is it guys but i'm very concerned why didn't you guys uh basically mention that you noticed that i skipped um question 3.1.3 b only one person managed to see that guys um okay and londi was able to to see that and imagine this video already has um 208 views but no one mentioned that to me guys what's happening please interact with me in the comment section if you notice that i've left something out please let me know so that i can quickly um fix that for you guys okay but then thank you so much lundi for um making me aware of that um i do record these video tutorials at night and sometimes i'm but tired so just make sure that um sometimes if you notice something just point it out to me and i'll make sure that i correct that okay but other than that guys that was it for question 3.1.3 b right and i'll see you guys on my next video tutorial that is it guys and i'll see you guys on my next upload a distance learning with lee where i make learning mathematics super easy Bye, guys.
Thank you.